Good morning. What a beautiful day here in Western Newfoundland. Today, um, run in and check some rabbit snares. Uh, check the coyote bait, just checked it now. This bait is still untouched. They ate my other one uh, a few videos ago, but this one's still untouched. So I did take the trail cam off the tree. And what I'm gonna do is go put the trail cam on a rabbit lead for now until the coyotes come near this. Cause they're not gonna eat all this in one night. And because they're not gonna eat it all in one night, I'll be up every day or every second day or so. So um, I'll be able to catch them here still and put the trail cam up and get some footage of them and see what time they're coming. So it's not a big deal. So for now, we're gonna take the trail cam. We're gonna put it on a rabbit lead that I think is gonna produce. I know NL Ghost Wolf does a lot of these and they're, they're really cool. I enjoy those a lot. Uh, watching the rabbits do their thing around the snares is really cool to see. So does Daryl Wells. I think he has a few clips like that. They're so cool to watch. Honestly, I shouldn't have put my rabbit snares out yesterday because we got so much snow last night, but I didn't know because it didn't call for that. It called for one centimeter accumulated which is not what we got. Like, my goodness, my coyote bait was buried. Like, look at this skidoo. We got, like, probably probably a foot, honestly, or close to it. Probably eight inches. I'll say eight inches. I know some of the snares I set out yesterday are going to be buried, and I, it is what it is. We're just going to go. We're going to go along and check. Let's go. So just for example, guys, this is snare number three, and this is kind of blocked in, honestly, like where I'm at right now. So probably just drifting covered this up, but I'll show you. Yeah, so that's pretty well useless now. The rabbit's head is gonna be directly above that snare. What I've got to do is just make an area around it and clear it out. That's all, no big deal. And because of the snow rise, he might never use this lead again. It might not even be a lead now, right? So that's, that's why I've got to keep coming back in the next couple of days and just see what they do. We're at the next snare here. And all this is snowed in so much. Look at this. I'm going to take that up. It was perfect yesterday, but there's literally no point to have this out and dig all this out. All right, so what we're actually going to do, guys, is put the trail cam here on this lead that was beat down. We'll get the one snare there now, and rabbits obviously didn't run last night. And I think I'm going to block that off and then put another snare there. And I'm gonna have the trail cam right here, point it down. So it should be some pretty cool footage. Let's get to it. We got our dome, we got her blocked in pretty darn good if I do say so myself. Snares tied on very securely. And we got the trail camera. Oh, say hi. Anyway, we've got the trail camera set up aimed right at her. So hopefully we get some footage out of this. I really hope we do. It seems to be, I don't know, it looks really cool. I really hope this works. Well, I hope that works. It seems pretty cool. I'm absolutely terrible with technology, so I have no idea if I have the trail camera working right. I think I do. I uh, did everything the manual said, so it's not my fault. It's Primos. We're just going to head up the road and check the rest of the snares. It's not looking too promising, but you got to check them anyway. Nothing in them. Had to beat them down. It's uh, certainly getting tough now for rabbits with the, the snow coming and going at fast rates. Makes it very hard to get your sets right. But at least we got a good view. Well, this is okay. We've got a bit of rabbit sign in here around this one. I think they may have just walked through here. So what I'm gonna do is block this off really good and block that off a little better with the, the snow level and uh, we'll get going. Alrighty, got her blocked off pretty well. Now, unless he wants to go right there around that tree, which if you do, we'll just put a snare there after. But I think this should be pretty good. So let's move on. I just rolled up on one and I was looking at these tracks. What do you guys think that is? Maybe a weasel or a martin or something. Now, I haven't went and looked yet. All I see is some blood. Ah, for frig's sakes. Look at this. Hole down there. How much is gone is the question. Oh, he's still good. He's still plenty good. Seems like anyway, just seems like maybe around the head was eaten, which I can definitely deal with. That's fine. Yep, he's good. Bit of the back leg, but hey, we can salvage him. He'll be good for soup or something. Look at that. There's his hole. So we won't reset this one. Definitely a Martin or something, hey. So we got another rabbit thief on the go we got to deal with other than the coyotes. <laughs> I like a challenge. I like a challenge. 
You know what? I don't know if he... Yeah, yeah, the back leg's definitely a little screwed there. That's all right, though. I just think it's... It is just one back leg, so I can deal with that 100%. But no, something definitely had a little feed, so... I think the rabbit's still good 100%. No damage on the meat anywhere, so... That's good. Well, not good, but it's better. Well, we got a bunny, so that's good. Next one untouched. Man, there's some dump of snow coming down in here. I'm just, I don't even know if I'm going to give these a week, like I said in my last video. I might not be able to, seriously. But we're going to clear that out, and we'll get going on to the last couple of snares. At the double set here now. Doesn't look too bad. Snow came up a little bit, but nothing much. And you can see in here, I think I see maybe only a couple sets of rabbit tracks. So that's good. I guess they never ran. So give me a chance to push all this up. So uh, let's get to it. Let's fix it. Alrighty, blocked in enough, I think. Smooth it out best we can here. And get on going to the last snare of the day. Last snare of the day, I don't even see it. Oh wait, is that maybe a rabbit foot I see? Take your bets guys, place it in the comments. Is that a rabbit foot? I'll spoil it for you, I think it is. Yay, look at this. Nice, 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 nice. So we did get a lot of snow last night, man. Holy crap. Beauty rabbit. That's a nice one. He's fat. Wow. But, you know, beautiful catch around the neck, just as you want. And uh, that's awesome. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to reset this one. And... We'll get on our way. Beautiful, guys, beautiful, two bunnies. Any day you get two bunnies is a good day in my opinion. Any day you get any bunny is a good day in my opinion. But especially the conditions we had last night, I don't really think they ran much. So I'll take two bunnies any day. You know, it's unfortunate uh, a Martin or something had a little snack on one of them, but that's all you can do. He's still perfectly good to eat. I'm gonna eat him anyway, I'm not gonna waste it. So we got two for the pot, that's awesome. Beautiful. Two nice bunnies for the pot. Gotta be thankful for that. Very cold day. Negative 13. I don't want to be out here, but I am. We got snares to check. Just made a modification to the coyote bait. I'm going to show you now. So I saw this on Google a while ago. I just never did it. I do do this sometimes when I try to call them in though. Put a wing or a tail of a bird on a stick and it blows in the wind like that. So you can imagine with the collar combined with this decoy, it would look pretty good. Dad actually told me to do this this morning just to get them over to the bait because there's tracks all the way over there going across the pond but they, they just haven't come here yet and once they find this they'll dig and they'll find the rest of it so this is just an enticer to get them here okay we got that done now i gotta go check the rest of my rabbit snares i've already checked two and we had one go to it and come back so a refusal it's a real good lead on the way in so i just had to stop and put one there right there get it marked off and we'll we'll keep heading up well guys, we just had the trail camera set. Would you look at this? We did have a bunny come in there. Looks like early this morning. Came in, really fresh actually, very, very fresh. Push it right to the side he did. Pushed it right aside. Right to the side, look at that. So we're gonna reset that and we're, we're gonna set it back down. Wow, I'm gonna take that home now actually and look at it and I'll bring it back up later today. So we have it up for tonight. That's crazy. We didn't get the rabbit. That's not awesome, but I mean, like, that's cool. I'm going to have this on video. That's just so cool to me. So I'm just going to make snare a little bit bigger and we'll get on our way again. Let's go. As we got to go on a little search here, Bunny took our snare and it looks like he went that way. Hmm. Took our snare, eh? We'll go have a look now. Turn off the skidoo and go have a look. The snare's right there. I'll put an arrow to it. I have no idea where he could be at. We're just gonna follow the tracks. I really don't know. We might have lost this guy, but I'm gonna look. Looks like he went here and doubled back. Oh, I see him. There he is. Look at that. Look at that. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Seemed like he went to go down in a hole. Perfect, guys, perfect. We got him. 
nice big bunny it's awesome i'm not actually going to put a snare there now i'm going to leave it and see if they use it again and then i'll put a snare there just because i trampled it and i don't know if they're going to use it again but i think a different bunny will so once they start running through here i'll put put another snare there So, they're starting to use this lead again. I honestly haven't had a snare in this one in like probably a week and a half. And uh, they're starting to use it again. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a snare there again and block it off. Simple. They're using it. Hell, I'm going to use it too. So, a little bit bigger. Gonna retweak it and uh, we should be good to go here. We're going to get this one set now like that and I'll show you it from my perspective. Alrighty, we got her good. Now, I'm no expert, but that looks like a beautiful snare to me. I think we can manage to catch a bunny here. Just going to mark that now in case he takes a stick because it's a tad loose. I don't think he will, though, and we'll be on our way. Beautiful set. I'm happy with this one. And nothing at the double set, but I do have very high hopes for that one when they start running there again, which they will. So that's all the bunnies for today, which I'm okay with. Um, we're going to head back home and look at the game camera footage. Um, I'm not sure if I had it going right. It wouldn't turn on when I uh, when I picked it up there. I might need to get some better quality batteries. Um, Dad told me it's not something you want to cheap out on his batteries for a trail camera, which makes sense, especially out in like negative 20. All right, we're home now. I just inserted the SD card. We've got eight videos and two pictures. I already looked at them. We got one video of the rabbit, and I'm going to show you it. So you know I'm not lying. There's a video of the rabbit. I know it says image, but it's not. It's video. You know there's me i'll show you now hit play i think my trail camera's broken disappointing not even the word for it guys but we didn't let that stop us we got it the next day um, we reformatted the sd card did everything the user manual says so there's no user error excuse this time it's a freaking blizzard. Didn't call for this, but I went out anyway. Honestly, I had to go below like 10 the whole time because snow was pounding my eyes. So we roll up on the first snare. It's pulled through. Um, I got two bunnies out of that snare this year, so we fixed that one. The next one, I'm just going to pat it down to compensate for the snow we're going to get, and here we All go. Right, so I know we had some issues with the trail camera, but we got her back in the lead now. I gave it to my father. He reformatted the SD card. He said everything should be working right. It's a possibility it's our computer, but I, I really doubted. So... What we're going to do in the next video, you're not going to see it in this one just because it would be a very long video and I like to get content out as fast as I can. Like I'm going to have to come check it tomorrow. So I'm going to release this video today. You're going to see all this in the next video. But what we're going to do is take it and check it. Uh, if anything runs through here, which he didn't run here last night, which is good. So it means he should run tonight. If anything is on there, we should see it. And if it's corrupted like the last uh, video was, we're going to have to return the camera. Something wrong with the cameras. So that's what's going on. You see we got her set up there. I haven't turned it on yet, but that's going to be its view. Should work. Should work. We got everything reformatted, like I said, so there's no excuses this time for user error. Turn her on. Just gave me the 10-second countdown to get out of here. And we're good. Let's go. So like I said, we got everything done exactly how the user manual says. First time, I'm just gonna give it the benefit of the doubt and say it was say it was us. We didn't really know how to how to work it, but you follow instructions. You kind of only got a limited room for error. You know what I mean? So hopefully it works and uh, we get some footage out in the next video. But we're gonna keep heading up here and see if we got any bunnies. So that's all for today guys thanks for watching i really hope you enjoyed uh, we get a few bunnies nothing crazy um i'm definitely gonna move from this spot now i think i've got seven snares out so i think next time start of the video what's gonna happen is we're gonna come up take these snares up and check them and take them up uh get the trail cam and we're, we're gonna move to a totally different trail so i'm gonna have zero snares out 
and uh, we're gonna start fresh. We're gonna move to a different trail I've got in mind just to give these rabbits up here a break. And yeah, uh, I do apologize about the trail cam footage. Um, we wouldn't have had a catch on video, but we would have had some footage of a rabbit running through the lead and pushing a snare to the side. So it would just be cool to see. And like I said, Daryl Wells and NL Ghost Wolf, I got the inspiration from you guys because I seen you guys do it first. And so I give credit where credit is due. I'm sure it's been done before, but that's just who I saw. Yeah, like I said, I apologize. There's no good footage in today's video, but that's all I can do. Um, it's kind of out of my control, honestly. I could wait three to five more days till I get some bunnies again with trail camera and go out and put a whole new set out and show you guys. But I think this, this will be a nice little video here. So I'll post this as is. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Um, you're gonna have to wait till next video to see the trail camera. See you then.